What's happening, world? It's your boy DJ Shine. Jeff Mater checking in. Another edition of Shine Live. You know what we do. We hit that record button every time we hit the road. And uh, this time we're going out to Cambridge. A uh, little dinky donkey type of gig. If you don't know what that means, don't ask me because I don't know what that means either. Needless to say, my boy Alvin Carter is uh, doing big things at Harvard University. And uh, he's already gotten me out there on a few gigs over the summer. Um, so we're actually heading out there right now. They have a beautiful new hip-hop archive, preservation-type museum-looking area that represents hip-hop and its culture. And uh, inside, the, inside the archive is a state-of-the-art Serato turntable setup. It's beautiful. All ready to go. Um, it's fun because I only have to bring my laptop, so that's great. And uh, this is only about an hour an hour and a half long of a gig. Um, I guess now that the archive is complete, they are giving tours to some of the some of the uh, big wigs at the university, um, allowing them the opportunity to see what their money's gone to. And uh, who else better but your boy Shine to be the representative as far as uh, the DJ is concerned at the Hip Hop Archive at Har Harvard University. So. I'm looking forward to it. Should be uh, should be fun. Should be easy. I mean, they really just want me to do my thing, and uh, you know, funkify Harvard University. So we're heading out. It's 3:30 uh, on Monday. Works out great that it's a Monday. How many of us DJs get the opportunity to work on a on an off night? Uh, I'll take it. And uh, looking to start at about five o'clock. So. We will bring you some live footage from inside the Hip Hop Archive as as the uh, show is going on. So we're here at Harvard at the Hip Hop Archive. This is a really, really, really cool place. Um, only a place like Harvard, I suppose, right? It is a haven for the hip-hop culturalist when they rock him you know they they didn't uh, they didn't skimp out so come on let's let's just show you around a little bit books and Put all kinds of. Well, since they both have them on glass. All kinds. Oh, that no, that works. Yeah, visually yeah. that works. Media. Yeah. And then. Culturally important oh, to hip hop. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah, put them next to get a lot of the lead. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the vinyl. That's perfect. That yeah. Perfect. Yeah, he needs to be over there. Oh, what Come on over here. Oh, uh, Posters. Got the. It's almost like cribs, you know what I mean? Like big screens, fancy furniture, a lovely spread of delicious breads and cheeses. That's not the important part. Here, here's the setup. All the equipment belongs to Harvard. Uh, two 1200s, there's the Rain TTM 57. Um, they, they have their own Uber stand, they have their own mic, they have their own headphones, they have their own sound system. I mean, Literally, the only thing that belongs to me is the computer. But I mean, you're talking one, one very cool space. Look around here, we got some cool posters. More 12 inches. Sorry for the reflections, but I think you can get the gist of the earth thing. We miss this Lauren Hill. We w we want this Lauren Hill back. Where's this Lauren Hill? <laughs> All kinds of vibes, source magazines. This this Foxy cover is December '98. This vibe is from '94, September '94. 
This is bananas. Bananas. More 12 inches all along the bottom here. Doggy style. <laughs> One of my favorite album covers of all time. But not only do they uh, give props to the old school, but the new school as well. You got the new, well, the newest Roots, newest Roots record. This, this is great. So we'll bring you some more as uh, as things progress. And uh, yeah, DJ Shine, Shine Live. That's how we do.